Hello, this is Marcia, and I'm going to give you an overview of ClassTools.net. There are a lot of different options that you can do in ClassTools.net that are a lot of fun for kids to do, such as fake Facebook. A lot of our students really like that because of the fact that it feels like Facebook, but it's fake. We have Pac-Man games. There is like a Trivial Pursuit, a timer, QR code generator. But today, what I'm gonna have you look at is we're actually gonna look at a wheel. We're gonna do a spinner, and the spinner is right here. So you could do it as a random name picker. So if you have a classroom set, you can put everybody's name in here. But what we're gonna to do today is we're gonna do some different tasks and tools. So I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna hit edit. And I just go in and I delete. So I'm gonna say, give some options. So I've written in some different options that the students can do just to spice things up, change up your classroom. When I'm done, I just hit submit, and now my spinner has those different options. I next need to hit save. When I hit save, I am going to save this list, give it a name, click OK. After the spinner is saved, you can now share it. So here is my spinner, it's ready to go. If I click to spin, I have the option to remove that item or I could just click and spin it again. I can share my spinner either through a link, I can embed it or even a QR code. So you could do one of these options for your classroom. Go ahead and create your own classtools.net spinner.